What is up guys, welcome back to another video. Vitals got a big update and we're on GNOME 47 again. This is probably available on GNOME 46, so you don't really have to worry about the whole backwards compatibility thing. But damn, it's now on version 69. Nice. And it adds the ability, wait till you see this. Oh, you get to see every single thing about your GPU. That's crazy. So I can now have my driver version number, my temperature of my graphics card right there, uh, the ability to see its utilization, how much power it's using because we are recording, and the percentage of the GPU that's being used total. And also there's my gigahertz for my CPU. Unfortunately, that and that are not side by side, but I wonder if I can drag it over. No, I can't. That would be cool, wouldn't it? That would be cool. I'm honestly very, very happy that they went and they updated this. And as you can see, monitor NVIDIA GPU beta is right there, including static GPU info. Uh, if you turn that off, you lose a couple things. So I turned it on. I'm not sure if it's going to cause an issue or not, but I disabled all of this other stuff. So we actually turned all this on. I just don't want everything monitored because it's a bit silly, but yeah. turn. I don't have a battery. Why am I turning battery on? Look at all this. I got no data on voltage because I haven't done anything with it yet. But let's try to make that uh, sensors detect. Nope. Hmm. Better score? Nope. Pseudo Pacman dash uh, LM sensors. No. Underscore sensors. No. See. I don't know. Sometimes this just does not want to work too well. So. It is installed. So maybe I'm just messing up the. Oh, I see the problem. Probably just screwed it up again, didn't I? Just going to hold this down. Till it's done. And then in here again, there's no data. So let's turn off the application. Turn it back on so it can read the data. And now we have all of our voltages just like that. Nice. We also have our RPMs for our fans. As you can see, there they are. And they're doing just what they should do. Processor, core, everything's here. Process time, usage. It is all there and ready to be read by Vitals. If you guys enjoyed this video, don't forget to leave a like, uh, subscribe to the channel because we do tons of Linux stuff. And I'm really happy that the Vital developers finally pushed forward on this. This is awesome. I'll see you guys in another video, probably Monday, or I'll leave one for Friday, Saturday, Sunday, um, probably Monday. I don't know. It depends if I can find something to do. Anyway, bye everybody.